Okay guys, a few episodes ago we went to the abandoned leper colony. It was scary in the day. Now lots of people have told us to go back on an evening. So we've got Danielle here <laughs> to come with us from Cases. We've She's got uh, trained uh, in self-defense. Trained in self-defense. That's why we're bringing her with us. I'm not ready to use it. <laughs> we've got the Knight Strider who's known for striding so he'll be getting out of there quickly. And we've got Laura here, the lovely Laura, who's going to try and charm them. And then, <laughs> then we've got me, who they'll probably ask for a selfie. But, <laughs> so we're going to go up there and we're going to see what it is like on an evening. It was scary dive by day, but it's going to be even scarier by night. Now, I'm sorry if there's a noise, wind noise, but we're having to take the GoPro because it's got low light, which is what we need. Is that full moon? And there's a full moon as well. So, <laughs> Without further ado, my friends, let's go! Okay, so we're on our way up now. And it literally is pitch black. It's creepy. Apart, it's creepy. Apart I can from just moonlight. See a silhouette of that church. It, it's not good. I don't think this is the best idea we've ever had. <laughs> I apologise for the sound, but we've got to use the GoPro. We'll do our best. Come on, onwards. Can you see anything, guys? Can you see anything? I can see the outline of the church. No lights up there. It's pretty very creepy I can just see black windows and I know what's up there in the light it was scary enough whose idea was you were all dropping comments go at night when we don't come back this video best get a million views come on oh ah oh jeez oh, can you see anything just my death up at the top of the hill <laughs> Anybody scared yet? Um, a wee bit. A wee bit, right, yeah. Before we, carry on, before we carry on, do we want to carry on? Oh, okay. We're here now, we've got to carry on. The viewers wanted it. Really I have to it. say, you can't see this on camera, but you can just see the outline of the church. It's a full moon, and oh, my hairs are standing up on my arm. It's a bit scary, I've got to say. Four of us went up, but how many of us will come down? <laughs> okay guys, just come here please. Lights on please, lights on. Nice. Daniel from Tenerife First Excursions, careful, used to live here, right? Well, not, not in the, in the not, leper village. Not in the, <laughs> <laughs> not in the leper village, but he live, did ne live near, near it. And uh, I asked him to come and he's a, like a fighter and stuff isn't he as well right well he sent us a message okay and i need to play this to you you need to listen to this as well can you light my face up on this um so basically uh he's basically put a message here so basically i lived in about it for it was six and a half years and um we we were basically told to never go up there at night time because of the type of people that are sleeping up there and um the type of people that kind of you know it's a kind of place where people uh, you know people that are lost confused maybe drugged up kind of end up there you know what i mean they're not accepted anywhere else on the island and you know it was initially built for lepers but you know the kind of misfits and freaks and weirdos of the island decided to use that as their base you know what i mean they leave there during the day and they sleep there at night and generally they don't take kindly to people, um, you know, disturbing them at night time. So, yeah, so generally we've not heard, heard good stories of people going up there and coming back in a great shape afterwards, you know what I mean? So just bring some something heavy that you can hit someone with and a good torch and, um, and some good running shoes, basically. I suggest ASICs, they're very good for running. So that if you do have to run, you can run and the biggest trick to running when you're with a group of people is not running fast it's running faster than the other people that are in the group 
So that's from Daniel who used to live here and he wasn't joking and that's literally how dangerous it is up here. Uh, it's not the ghosts, it's the people that live up here. So come on, are we all in? Yeah, there's a crazy dog, rabid dog barking. There, there is a there. rabid dog barking over there, yeah. That's the worrying thing. There's the man over there, but I think he's the owner of the dog. I say let's just get this done, come on. It's get, I'm getting a bit worried now, let's just go. Come on, onwards. Let's go, let's keep going. Come on, onwards. Oh, Jesus. I'm not sure, there's pe there is people there. There's people there, there's two men and a woman. Two there's men and a woman. there's people in, in the building, you can't see it on the line, and we're not doing this just for the, the vlog. There is people in there, and we don't know how friendly they are. They might not be. see this on there but there's a, there literally is a light I don't know if you can see it on the GoPro. Why, why don't you go a bit closer? And... <laughs> Thanks for pushing me. Thank you. 
Which way? Oh, I can't see. Oh shit, there's three of them at the top. They're just looking. There's three, I can't see, I can't see. Three of them, there's three of them looking at the top. Them lot have bloody left me. <sighs> Wait a minute. Oh, jeez. Let's regroup, guys. Not lights under the. <laughs> there literally was. So it's not. We're not talking ghosts, but there was two men and a woman. There was two men and a woman in the end, and they were staring at us. Just keep an eye behind because they were they were looking at the top as well. They were in the window, and then they came out, and they were just literally walking towards us. You couldn't see it on camera. That was mental. I can't go any further. I mean, there's loads more buildings. But I don't even think I'd want to go in there. You wouldn't know who was in what room. You wouldn't know who was wrong. in what room. We literally went into the church. There was pigeons in there, dead pigeons. No, not, not, not an ideal. I wouldn't advise it. It's dangerous, like Daniel said. Anyway, I think we're going to go for a drink now for the attic. <laughs> so, like, subscribe, click that little bell for notifications, and don't do this yeah, don't, at home. Don't. <laughs> don't try and do this, guys. It's not clever and it's not big. Anyway, <laughs> <laughs> and we'll see you guys hopefully. Oh, shit, that's so many. It is. Oh. Let's go get out of here.